Good morning, folks. We've got a look at space weather, including what's expected today. We're going to see a solid study confirming one of the components of the ocean shutdown, and we've got a big announcement for Friday. But let's begin with the last 24 hours on our star, and while some minor pops were seen at the northern departing active regions, it was largely a quiet day. We've got a bit of a break from the flaring and larger eruptions, but we'll be keeping an eye on the incoming sunspots now as well, with them entering visibility. Yesterday we showed the strong GOES magnetometer hit during the moderate CME impact and said it was unexpectedly strong. Today we've got word from Dr. Tony Phillips, spaceweather.com, that it was indeed unusually strong. Rare red aurora, which haven't been so rare the last year, were seen as the magnetometers in Canada and Europe showed even stronger deviations. As with the past events, this space weather should not have been strong enough to do this normally. But our weakening magnetic field and the ongoing pole shift is leaving Earth's upper atmosphere more vulnerable. We're also watching for more geomagnetic activity today, as the last of those CMEs we identified last week is expected to impact Earth today. We'll have our eyes on the solar wind as well. Folks, a good paper has been released confirming the slowdown of the Gulf Stream. It is now beyond random chance that this is a usual anomaly, and it adds to the AMOC shutdown and Beaufort Gyre release coming for a complete picture that our oceans are changing very rapidly. Next Dansgaard Oshker event and Heinrich event is on deck. When it comes to catastrophism, there have been significant figures in the field over time with modern day bringing us several key figures, most of whom you know from this channel and their work on the disaster cycles. On Friday, the two 1984 babies, Jimmy Corsetti from Bright Insight and myself, will be live together discussing these topics on his YouTube and Rumble channels. More details to come, but we are expecting that to be at 6.30 p.m. Eastern, 4.30 p.m. Mountain Time, 3.30 p.m. Pacific, our first public interaction following many private conversations. Going to be a good one. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6.30 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.